Good morning, Alex. How are you doing today? Good morning, Steve. I'm really good. I don't feel sick at all. Actually, I'm just really excited that we're going to have a baby. That's awesome. I'm so excited as well. I can't <laughs> believe it. We've got this beautiful house. Uh, we've got mm -hmm. an amazing garden. And now we're having a baby as well. It's awesome. I know, I know. And look at my belly. It kind of grew a little bit. Let me see. Oh, my gosh. You're Can getting you a bump see? already. That's awesome. There's a little you know bump. What? We're gonna have to do we're gonna have to build the baby bedroom so it's ready for when the baby arrives mm, yeah i know but what were we thinking of building it should we get rid of this wall over here yeah i think so if we get rid of this wall here put some mm -hmm. steps and then all that space out there we can build an awesome baby bedroom oh that would be amazing steve okay um can we do it right now i mean yeah. i'm so excited well all morning i was working i was chopping down some trees and getting some wood <gasps> and i was making some glass as well so it's all in there and look awesome. at that garden we have everything for our garden as well oh my gosh show me everything grew so quick oh steve you're just the best Okay, You're I'm really good farmer. Because really, we're going to need really to make good. lots more money for our baby bedroom, for all the furniture as well. Yeah, I know. You're right. We actually need loads of furniture. But we don't really know if we're going to have a boy or a girl. I mean, how are we going to choose the colors if we don't know? Uh, okay, maybe we should start the bedroom. And then before we have to decorate it, maybe we should go to the hospital and get a scan and see <gasps> if the baby's a boy or a girl. Oh gosh yes uh yeah do you think they'll be able to be to do a scan so early on in the pregnancy uh i think so i mean they should be able to already i mean with the modern technology they probably will oh this is so exciting steve i cannot believe it everything is working out so well between us it's gonna be awesome okay i'm gonna put all this stuff in the fridge to make sure it stays fresh before we mm -hmm. sell it down the market Okay. I have three pumpkins, pumpkins here as well. So I'm yeah, going to put them in as well. Perfect. What oh my gosh, this is so exciting. Okay, so I got a stone pickaxe. So I'm ready to destroy the wall. I'm going up. I'm going up. Okay, go for it. Go for it. Go for it. This is so exciting. Let's make the bedroom really big, yeah? Uh, yeah, we can definitely make it a big bedroom for is the baby. Is it going to fit? I think it will. It should be okay. Oh, this is going to be hard labor for us, Steve. But yeah, it's okay. Don't be working too hard now because you're pregnant. Okay, yeah, look, I know. There's I some know. steps. Oh, perfect. That's awesome. So we're okay. going to leave like a little border here, right? Uh, yeah. Okay, lovely, lovely. So what about windows? We've got to put the windows down first, maybe. Um, yeah, so will we make it all windows over here? Like this? That side as well, yeah. Very nice. I like it. I like it. Oh, I don't like this. I like it. This. I like this. That looks cool. Okay, all the way down this side as well. Isn't that too much windows? Okay, uh, this wall I think is the baby's not gonna, gonna be have windows. an awesome view. Very awesome view. It might be better than our view. The baby is really lucky. <laughs> Absolutely, it's gonna be such a nice bedroom. I'm so excited to find out though if it's gonna be a boy or a girl. I know. And we have to think about the names as well. I mean, if it's a boy, what are we going to call? If it's a boy, we can call it Alex. And if it's a girl, we'll call it uh, Stevie. No, <laughs> we can't call them the same names. We need some good name suggestions. Yeah. Like Alexandra. Alexandra for a, for a boy. No, <laughs> Alexandra is a girl's name, you silly. How are you getting on with the roof? Uh, good. I'm gonna put down some wood stairs to make it look cool. Okay. okay. Right. I'm gonna just. Oh, this actually looks really, really good, Steve. Look awesome. Awesome. I okay. love it. Our baby is gonna be loving this for sure. <gasps> wow. Now you're stuck outside. I am. I'm stuck outside. That's not fair. Should we okay. leave it like an uh, open plan for now? Because while the baby is still small, maybe we need to watch over him or her. Yeah, we, w we need to be able to get inside all the time. Yeah, so I mean, maybe we should put a door there for now. Okay, no doors for now. No uh, doors Let me for see, now. I'm still doing the roof up here. But it's okay, okay it's looking let good. Let's see, this one, I might put the stairs, the step just over here would that work hmm no not really so Looking how are you good. getting on with the roof i got three more blocks to do and we're all done oh my gosh oh my gosh this is so exciting but i am getting pretty hungry uh, 
I'm kind of stuck up here. How do I get down? Just break. Break it. <laughs> okay, I'm coming through the roof. I'm coming through the middle. Through the middle? Okay, but you better put it back. Here I am. Show me. <gasps> wow. Okay. Check no, we could this do. Out. We could make like a skylight so that the baby can look at the stairs at night time. Oh, yeah. That's a great idea. Oh, yes. Amazing. We should get one as well, actually. Yeah. I, I like then. this. There you go. <gasps> Beautiful natural light all year round. Awesome. Okay, gonna I'm look gonna so do pretty. one for us as well. Okay, so we can put the bed over Yay. here and then we can put some toys and stuff down here as well and a little wardrobe too. That's gonna be so cool. I know, but we just This need is to kinda dangerous though. Yeah, we have to block this up here. Because the baby could just walk straight off the steps. Oh, we probably need like a little fence or something. Yeah, just put some glass up. Mm, I don't think this makes it safer. I mean, Those it's glass. What if the baby? Off. What if the baby just walks in the glass and hits? It's okay. It's strong glass. It's not gonna work. Okay, it's not gonna work. <laughs> it's not gonna fall out. Okay, okay so I think we're I think done. This is the baby bedroom. It looks awesome. The baby can see down to all the animals down there. It's gonna oh. be so cool. Uh, so I guess we should enter town, sell our fruit and veg, and then go and buy some stuff for the baby's bedroom. Oh well, wait, first, we gotta go to the hospital first and find out if it's a boy or a girl. I know, but do you know where the hospital is? I mean, the I doctor do. came over to us the last day. We're gonna have to get the bus. It's kind of far away. It's in the city center, so it's uh, gonna take a bit of time. Okay, that's all right. I'm just so excited. Well, Steve, who do you think it is? Is it a boy or a girl? Um, I think it's going to be. Oh, look at all the fruits after growing already again. Oh, awesome! What is it gonna be, Steve? Come on, tell me. I think it's gonna be a boy. Mm, I think it's gonna be a girl. A little baby girl. Little Steve Jr. No, little Alex Jr. It's gonna be Steve Jr. Maybe it's gonna be both. <gasps> Can you imagine? What if we have twins? What are we gonna do? Oh my gosh, twins. We're gonna need two bedrooms. Oh my gosh, no. You know what? They can share. I have to extend the whole house out this way and make it even bigger. Mm. I think our house is pretty big already. Yeah, but I if mean, we're gonna have twins, we're gonna need an even bigger house. Oh my gosh, please no. Wait, I don't you I know that get all twins the twins is edge. such a hard job. We'd never imagine like if one is sleeping and then the other one is crying and then you have to change the nappies and then you have to feed them. Oh my gosh, I'm freaking out. Please, 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 have I'm freaking twins. out. Yeah, but it'd be so much fun to have what they both have best friends, boys and girls. And they have brothers and sisters, and they'd always be best friends. I guess. Wow, look at the house. It looks it's amazing. Perfect. If you think about it, we started with absolutely nothing. Remember the first day we met? No, and now we, we have this at all. amazing farm with animals, with fruits and vegetables, an amazing house. Wow. And you know what? I still have to build a road down here to the village so that everybody knows where we are and they can drive down. Oh, and I know. Look, there's a fox. Be careful. <gasps> Oh, I really don't like the foxes. Uh, they just look evil. I don't know why. When I look at foxes, I'm really scared of them. Ah, uh, they're not too bad. They're going to be nice to you. Yeah, do you okay. know that they want to eat our animals? Especially the chickens. Chicken, oh, look, be careful. There's a the fox The baby's there. over here as well. Hey, babies. We're having a baby as well. Look, so Hi, you babies. guys can be friends with our baby <laughs> when it's born. Well, they all they won't be babies anymore when our baby is born. And when our baby is their age, I guess they're going to be like six or seven. Come on, Alex, hurry up. Okay, let's okay, go. Okay, which uh, way are we going? Where's the bus stop? We're going to go down here first and sell all our pumpkins and our melons. We're going to get some money. Then we're going to jump on the bus and go straight to the hospital. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So let me talk to this guy. All right. Hi, George. How are you today? So we've got some more pumpkins and watermelons for you. Would you like some? Oh, yes, absolutely. Throw them up on the shelf there and I'll grab you some money. Those are oh. the freshest, most organic <laughs> stuff we have in the whole store. Oh, thank you so much, George. That's awesome, George. Thank you. Okay, let's grab the money and head straight to the hospital. Oh, here we are, Steve. 
That's it. This is the hospital. Come on, let's go. Let's go find out if we're having a boy or a girl. This oh is my gosh. I'm so excited. Are you excited? I'm really, really excited. I really want to know who it is. I just hope, you know what? At the end of the day, it doesn't really matter. I just hope the baby is nice and healthy. Um, Hi, sir. We're just here for a baby scan. Uh, yeah, no problem. I'm just on the phone here, but uh, you guys can head up to uh, the second floor. I think there's a doctor uh -huh. there here to take care of you, okay? Okay, thank you very much, sir. Awesome, thank you oh very much. Oh my gosh, Appreciate okay, it. second floor. I think it's this way. Are you following me, Steve? Yeah, I'm right here. Are you excited? I'm really excited. I want to know <laughs> if it's a boy or a girl so that we can start getting the baby room set up in blue or in pink. Yeah! Okay, so where do we go from here? He did say second floor. second floor. Second floor, second floor. Maybe he meant upstairs and third floor. Mm, maybe. Come on, this, follow me. This doesn't look like the baby scanning facility room. This hospital's so big. Are you going to have your baby up here? Like, are you going to give birth so. up here? Well, I'm not going to give birth at home. Are you crazy? Doctor. Oh, yes, hey, yes. doctor. How are you, sir? We're just here for a baby scan, please. Oh, absolutely. That's no problem whatsoever. Just grab a seat there and I'll go get everything <laughs> set up for you. Thank you very much, sir. Awesome. That's so cool. Okay, yeah, uh, that's it. So uh, he's going to come back soon uh -huh. and he's going to uh, do the exam and then we're going to find out. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited, Steve. No, Alex, here we go. We're going to just do a quick little scan of your pregnancy to find out if you're having a boy or a girl. I just have a little device here to wave over your belly. Let me have a look here. There we go. There we go. Okay, now I'm going to go into the lab and get the results. I'll see you downstairs with your fellow Steve and I'll give you the results straight away and we'll find out if you're having a wonderful little boy or a baby girl. Steve! Oh, hey there! <laughs> How's it going? How did the exam go? Um, it went fine. He put some gel on my belly and then he used the scanner thing and he said he will have the results in a few minutes. Awesome. Yeah, I just saw him walking into his office there, so he's probably doing the test now to find out if we're having a boy or a girl. Sit down beside me. Sit beside oh me. my gosh, I just cannot believe it. Oh, this is so exciting. In just a few minutes, we're finally gonna find out. I know, it's gonna be awesome. I can't wait to find out. We're gonna have a little boy or a little a girl and then we can do up the bedroom and make it pink or blue or maybe we can just make it green oh <laughs> uh, yeah we could make it green or yellow even that would mm, be nice yeah. but be cool. if it's a girl i'd still prefer to make it like pinkish and stuff like that and if it's a boy then we can make it nice and blue green and blue just like me or else we make a green and brown just like you well, actually, you're <laughs> blue on blue. You're just light blue at the top and dark blue at the bottom. Awesome. Loves of blue. It's going to be so much fun. Okay. Should we go inside now to the doctor um, and find out what we're going to have? Just let me check, okay? Um, knock, Steve's knock. Doctor, can we come in? Oh, why, absolutely, Alex oh. and Steve. Come on <laughs> in. I've got the results right here. I've got come some in, very, Steve. very exciting news for both of you. Oh, my gosh, doctor. What is it? Is the baby healthy? Oh, absolutely. Your babies are very, very healthy. Did well, you just say babies? I did indeed, Alex. What? I'm, I'm going to tell you that you're having twins. Isn't that <gasps> exciting? What? Oh, my gosh. <gasps> what, what, what is that? What does that mean? We're having what? twins? Is this it, is crazy. Is it two I'm, girls? Is it two boys? Is, is it a girl or a boy? What is it, doctor? Well, I don't know what you'd prefer, so it looks like you're having one of each. <laughs> oh, Are you having a boy and what? a baby girl? Oh Are you going God. to be a family of four? Isn't that wonderful? That is wonderful. Um, That's oh amazing. Gosh, I can't believe it. Alex, we're going to have twins. That's so cool. Whoa, we're going to have a baby girl and a baby boy. This oh. is awesome. A baby girl and a baby boy. That means we're going to need a bigger bedroom and a bigger house. Oh my gosh, we're going to have a family <laughs> of four. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much, doctor. Um, Should I come back for a checkup anytime soon? Absolutely, Alex. We'll have to see you every few weeks to do a checkup because we've got two babies in there now, so her belly's going to get <laughs> very, very big. Thank you, doctor. Thank you so much. Come on, Steve. I cannot believe it. Only this morning we were talking about, imagine if we'd have twins and I was freaking out. But now that I know it's twins, I'm actually so happy. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. We're having twins. One little boy, one little girl. We're going to have to pick two names and get two <laughs> bedrooms and get a bigger house. Oh my gosh, I think I'm going to have to get a new job as well to pay for all this stuff. Um, 
it's okay. We're just gonna have like a bigger farm, Steve. Uh, the vegetables and the fruits are growing so good. We can get some more animals from the forest and get more eggs and more meat. Uh, yeah. We're gonna figure it out. It's I'm gonna, gonna have be to great. get a much bigger farm at the back of the house. Maybe extend the house a little bit. Start making more and more plants and get more and more <laughs> animals. Because we're gonna have such a big family. We're gonna need lots of money for going to school and clothes oh and toys gosh. and everything. Oh my gosh, stop it, stop it. Okay, they're just babies. They're not even born yet and you're already panicking. It's going to be amazing. The only thing we have to worry about now is to sort out the bedrooms, okay? Yep. And all the little beds and toys and stuff like that. And also sort out the names. Okay, I mean, well, we let's need to uh, figure out the names. Let's go to the store and buy some blue beds and some pink beds. <laughs> and then we can go home and we can set up the bedroom, okay? Okay, come on, let's go. There's the bus there. Hurry. Oh, wow, Steve, we got so much stuff. Oh my gosh, the baby bedroom is going to look super cool. But uh -huh. you know what? I think it's a little bit small. So maybe in a couple of months before the baby comes, I can make it a bit bigger for two of them. Yeah, sure. But there's no rush on that because they're still going to be just small babies. They won't be able to walk or to talk. So this bedroom will be fine for them. Don't I worry. Know, but I've got to make some more money as well to make sure we can make it bigger. <laughs> and look awesome. Okay, so I've got a lamp for over here. Nice. What about the toys? Jess is going to go yeah. there. Perfect. Okay, maybe we put the cradles over here. Uh, yeah, one over here and okay. one over there where you are. Okay, there's one right there. Yay! Oh, I'm in the cradle. Oh, so cute. We're going to have the boy here and the girl here. Okay, so the boy goes there. Mm -hmm. And the girl's going to go there. Yes, awesome. <laughs> oh my so gosh, cute. it's so pretty already. I love it. Yeah, me too. I think it looks really, really cute. Let me see. Let's put this down here. Now. Mm -hmm. Oh, that it's looks awesome, perfect. It? Uh, I think we need a little bit of blue here. Yeah. There you go. That's it. Gorgeous. Look at that, Steve. Can you believe it? We're going to be parents. We're going to be mom and dad. I know. I'm so excited. I can't wait for this. And you know what? This is a cool bedroom <laughs> because even at night time, we can still see through to the bay bedroom. We can keep an eye on them. Yeah, of course. We can make sure they're nice and safe. Or except over here by the stairs. I think we need a little fence or something in case they crawl out and they fall off. Yeah, I can definitely build that. And you know what? Our babies are going to be so happy because they've got loads of animals to play with. And they've got a whole forest out there to have loads of fun and build a tree house exactly, and everything. Exactly. Exactly. It's going to be amazing. And a tree house is an amazing idea. We can use any of these trees, even over here, and build a nice tree house. Yeah, and you know what? Look, out the back garden as well. I'm going to have to build a farm a bit bigger. Maybe on this side over here, I can put loads more plants and loads mm -hmm. more vegetables and fruit so that we can sell them all and make loads of money. Yes, yeah, Steve. And don't worry. Don't panic, okay? We're going to be a happy family. It's going to be great. Are you hungry? I am absolutely starving, Steve. What are some... we going to have? I think we're going to have some chicken today. Mmm, delicious. Oh, there's loads of chicken Sorry eggs, actually. Chicken. There you go. Awesome. I'm just going to put the chicken eggs. Where are we supposed to get out? Oh, I didn't Over even here, see that. Over here, look. Awesome. Okay. Just going to put the chicken in the oven, and then we can mm. have our dinner. And then, you know what we're going to do? What? We're going to make our farm a little bit bigger so we can make loads of money. Oh, sounds good. Okay, well, I think we should expand. You know, like right now, we're only doing watermelons and pumpkins. What if we grow some vegetables as well, like tomatoes, lettuce, cucumbers? Yeah, definitely we could do that. We could grow lots of different things. And um, I'm so hungry. You hungry? Mm. Uh -oh. uh, excuse me. Uh, I, excuse uh, me, Steve. Uh, sorry about that. I'm Did you I just literally just eat everything? everything? Sorry about that. I need to get some more chicken. Ah, okay. There's like three of us in my body. We need some food. I know. Hurry, sorry about Steve. that. Steve, I'm you need hungry. You need lots of extra food yum, for your yum, belly yum, now. Yum, yum. For my two amazing babies that I've grown inside me, we still need to figure out the names. I think it's going to be pretty tough to come out with some oh new Oh my gosh, you know cool what, Alex? Names. We need a boy's name and we need a girl's mm -hmm. name. So maybe um, our friends at home can give us uh, a bit of a help with that. Yeah, a few suggestions, guys, in the comments below, please. Yeah, please. We need a boy's name and we need a girl's name mm -hmm. for us, our babies. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Maybe you just call them Alex and Steve, number one and number two. No, because we are number one and you're number okay. two. <laughs> there's your dinner. There's your dinner. Mm. Sit down there. Grab some dinner. Why can't... Oh, oh my gosh. I already ate it. Uh -oh. Get it already. 
Oh, you know what? I'm we're gonna still have to get hungry, more though. chickens and more animals as well because you're gonna be eating so much food now. Uh, this is the cooked pork chop. That is from yesterday, but you can eat it. It's okay. Oh, delicious! I love it. Okay, come on. Uh, let's go outside now and start getting the farm together so we can uh, grow some more stuff and make some more money for our okay, new family. Okay, let's do it.